Good morning, John. It's Esther Day. I love you. I love you. I'll get there eventually. I promise. People who don't know who Esther was, she was an awesome nerd fighter who did a lot of amazing things with her friends, and we really loved her. And she would have turned 17 today if she had not died because of the cancer inside of her. Esther is the reason why John and I are always wearing these bracelets, which you can buy at DFTBA.com. They're $5, and all the proceeds, of course, go to the This Star Won't Go Out Foundation, which helps children with cancer and their family. So last year when Esther was really sick, John uh, said to her, Esther, we will do whatever you want us to do on your birthday in perpetuity. Uh, whatever you want, we will do that. And she could have been like, I want you to shave your head. I want you to wax your chin. I want you to eat a hamburger made out of compact discs. But no, Esther was like, I want you guys every year on my birthday to talk about family and love. Now this is very sweet, but she also, she, she knew what she was doing here because John and I have had a long-standing agreement to not use the L word when talking about one another. And up to that point, there had been much discussion in Nerdfighteria, like, Why don't you guys ever talk about how you love each other in your video blogs? What is this voice? But despite the fact that people were always asking us to do it, John and I do not use the L word. This is a long-standing agreement, like, from birth. But Esther told us to, and when someone that you respect is about to die, you do what they tell you to do, you know? But here's the thing about Esther Day. It's something that she asked us to do a little bit for her and a little bit for Nerdfighteria, but mostly I think it's something that she asked us to do for ourselves, and that's pretty special. From the perspective of being kind of both at the beginning of her life and very much at the end of her life, she had, I think, a special kind of wisdom that we shouldn't ignore. She knew that loving each other is pretty much the most important thing that we do. It's not just the reason that each of us as individuals exist, it's the reason why, like, our species is ex it's the reason why our civilization exists, it's the only reason why we can do these marvelous, magnificent human things. John knows that I love him even if I don't say it, but like Dumbledore said, words have power and we have to use the magic of our words on each other so that we can feel it and experience it and the people that we love know viscerally and without a doubt how we feel. So we have to use the power of our words. It's Esther Day, that's what this is about. Tell the people that you love that you love them so that they know. Dad, I love you for being an excellent father and helping us out when we need it, never complaining about how weird your sons are. Mom, I love you for being proud of your sons even when they were doing weird, weird things that didn't make any sense to anybody. And John, I will get to you later. In the comments of this video, let us know who you love and how you're gonna tell them that you love them. And also in the comments of this video, yeah, I, uh, I, mi I missed a video and that uh, was all my fault. So you get to punish me. So punishment ideas as well. I'm sorry, your pants is still down. It has been hacked. And that is annoying, but the YouTube comments still work. Or if you want to leave them on Twitter, hashtag punish Hank. John uh, missed a video, but that's because he was having his abdomen cut open and his gallbladder removed. So you don't get to punish him. Just to be clear, that's a medical exception. And yes, VidCon was totally awesome. That is a poster with all of the, the signatures from all the speakers at VidCon, which is extremely cool that I get to have it in my house. We're gonna auction it off at the Project for Awesome, but until then, it's mine. John, I'm looking forward to seeing your video about VidCon on Friday. I just assume that's what you're gonna be doing. I love you.